Open the shipping box and remove the electrical cord. With one or two people, lift the machine onto a flat surface. The power cord connects at the back of the instrument. Plug in the instrument. Open the five reagent bottles. Insert the five labeled reagent cannulas into their respective bottles. Make sure the reagent pack is positioned directly to the left of the machine and all the cannulas are completely submerged in the reagents. Insert the waste line into the waste container. Insert the water cannula into the DI water container. Supplement the DI water container with 10 drops of iodine per gallon of water. Remove the four thumb screws and open the front panel on the machine to expose all the pump tube rollers. Stretch all the orange pump tubes onto the rollers. The panel covering the pump tube can now be replaced. Power on the instrument by pressing the on switch in the back. From the main menu, press 2 on the keypad to select setup. Press 2 again to select consumables. Press 1 on the keypad to select review reagents. This display will show the current kit's information. Press 1 on the keypad to select change kit. Once the blinking cursor appears next to the kit number, use the keypad to enter the kit number as it reads on the new reagent kit label. Enter the lot number and expiration date into the appropriate fields as it reads on the new reagent kit label. Press the pound key to select accept and save the kit registration information. Now press the star key to exit. Press 1 on the keypad to update reagent log and activate the kit. The Gram Pro 1 is now ready to operate.